Greetings out there in YouTube land from the planet Earth. This video has given me a real problem. I, uh, the picture didn't want to come up. I tried to put a thumbnail on there. It, it didn't go. I tried a couple of others. It's showing one now if I look in uh, Video Manager. But when I look on my page, it's not even there, supposedly, but it is in the list. You know? But I was looking at that dog and it reminded me of some of the animals I've had. The Lord richly blessed me with animals. And one in particular. Uh, my dog, uh, Sheba. Oh, above and beyond. Think of special forces, and then you, then, then you, then you think of my dog right there when it came to training. I taught my dog the dangers of hands and feet. How people can be distracting, so not to get distracted by one hand, to watch out for the hands and feet. I taught her to play fight at night. Um, she was a combination of a purebred husky and a purebred lab that did some um, bred, uh, breeding of their own while the owner was busy doing some breeding and wasn't paying attention. So I got her for 50 bucks and a Cujo and steroids. She was so smart. I taught her several languages and hand signs. She would walk by my right hand side with her head by my knee. And if there were people coming in front, she would just speed up enough just to get in front of me and then cut back to my left hand side to be between me and them always um you couldn't come up behind me or she'd growl at you. you couldn't go into the fridge because daddy was the giver of food i used to give rabbits head start till they get ready and then give a rabbit a head start so and and then send her after it and then tell her to stop and if she's about to bite it she would stop i mean we just i really love animals and the lord has really blessed me with them but I know there's a lot of you animals out there. But I use one saying a lot, uh, especially in the beginning. Um, and uh, people say too much things to animals in the beginning. To, and again, they, don't, they don't understand. And people just ramble on sometimes. And I found keeping it simple worked for me. And when there's something, I would always say, Daddy fix. Don't worry. Give Daddy a minute. Daddy fix. Daddy fix. And so they, they learned when I'd say that. No matter if they, if they want to buy the bowl. And like, okay, Daddy fix. So I said, just wait. Daddy fix. And, and they learn that. Third time is some uh, minor little problem that works for the cats here too. I say, Daddy fix. He said, No, to wait a second, and I'll take care of it. No matter what the problem is, that one saying has got me through a lot of problems, right? And it works. And I've got some uh, amazing LC here. His father was a gift from God, and he is too. I didn't even realize it. And they're my first cats, right? Although I was a dog person, but I had reptiles, scorpions. All manner of serpents, uh, reticulated python, Burmese python, you name it, right? I had a basculus that runs on the water, no leaf swifts, uh, the dual swifts I really liked them, they're pretty, like a dancing rainbow, uh, chameleons, you name it, right? I had my own little zoo there, and some exotic, uh, fish as well, right? Back in the day, many, many thousands of dollars worth of exotic pets, which are worth a lot more today by today's prices compared to what I paid for them back then a long ago, right? I had my own jukebox, pinball machines, you know. Interesting times. The thing I loved best was the animals. They brought me great joy. So love on your little ones today. Remember they're descendants of the ark. And God loved them so much he had an ark made for them. Think about that and love on them today. Bye-bye.